Hello there, this is Dave Allen from No Stylus website and today let's have a look at what we can do to do some work with the settings for Safari in the iPad. So let's go into settings and usually it takes you through to general. So the first thing to do is to scroll down just a wee bit on this list on the left hand side and go into Safari. Now one of the things that you can do is you can change the search engine. At the moment it's set for Google and I could have that set to Bing just for a change. Why not? And we can have the autofill on or off and you can tell it whether you use your contact info or not and whether it's going to store names and passwords. I generally leave those both on so that works fine for me. And another thing that you might want to do is if you're going to visit those porn sites click that private browsing on. But we're not going to look at it porn sites, we're going to take off private browsing. And click on keep all again. So another thing that you might want to do there is if you're using this on the MiFi or if you've got a 3G enabled iPad, they might want to know which websites are using up the most data. So if you go to the advanced tab and go to website data, you can see which websites are being used the most. So that could be very useful information there. So there you go, that's a couple of things that you can do with setting up Safari on your iPad. This is Dave Allen for No Stylus. Bye bye now. Thanks for watching the video and why don't you check out the other videos, here's two of them. There's one video there and one video there that you can click on and go and have a look at now. And don't forget that you can also subscribe. Talk to you again soon, bye bye now.